Change your diet, change your life, change the planet. Six twenty in the morning, breakfast time. Pink grapefruit, bananas or banana. I'm only gonna eat one. Jeff, what are you eating? What do you got? Banana. Banana. Dinner last night was avocado and banana. Yum, really good. So we're uh, munching down. Got about two and a half hours before the race. We'll see you in Miss. This place on earth? I did. Should I move here? Yeah. Okay. We're gonna move here. This is like the day for this town to shine. Everybody in town comes out. They're all like totally psyched. So this is their moment. So let's rock it. You think this is gonna be like a normal stair climb or is this gonna be No no no, this right? is this is more of a running race with stairs thrown in, just you know, intermittently. There's nine different stairways. Uh, the biggest is 181 stairs. There's a couple other ones in the 150s, but really the stairs are just kind of a little obstacle in between the running race. I'm not going to hammer too hard on the stairs, at least in the beginning of the race. just want to see what everybody else is doing and see how I'm feeling. And then I save it for the last half, because I think that's where a lot of people are going to be hurting. First place, Steven Orton. Yeah, Tim. 49, 48. Yeah, 40 years old. New record. Yeah. Just say a few words about this event so we can tell the press what to do. First of all, this is the coolest town I've ever seen. This is the toughest race I've ever done. I got this. Isn't that cute? It's handmade. How about you, Larry? Larry nice job. This is the coolest so, award I've ever seen. This is awesome. Kid that's here that's awesome. That all right, so I'm switching out shoes here. Ran the uh, 4.3 mile race in these guys, and uh, that race was really tough. Um, I won and I broke 30 minutes. I set the course record. First person under 30 minutes in the Bisbee 1000. So I'm really pleased about that. But now we're about to do the Iceman and I'm gonna wear the Vibram Five Fingers. And the Iceman race is one stairway, 151 stairs, carrying a 10 pound block of ice with ice tongs. So you gotta run up the stairs with an ice block. Last year the winner did it in 23.9 seconds, which to me sounds ridiculously fast. So, uh, I don't know, I'm a little scared. I'm thinking I might get my butt handed to me in this race. Okay, I just looked at these stairs. 23.9 seconds, won this last year. I don't know how that's possible. Who's got some courage? Just 155 steps. Only 10 pounds of ice. Runner, on your mark, get set. I wear them as much as, as I can. I would wear them 24 hours a day if I could. Most comfortable thing I've ever had on my foot. The thing's heavy for a skinny guy. The steps aren't that bad. Was it awkward carrying it? A little bit, yeah. Did it like holding the hold up with the pole helps though? So. Okay, so we're near the top of the Iceman stairs, and it's a serious climb. Way to go! Push, 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 yes! yes! Go push, 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 push. Under 30 pounds. And you've got the first place time coming up this so far. Yes, I, I do so far. That's impressive. We'll see. That is impressive. We'll see how long it lasts. <laughs> this is it. Keep going. Push, push. Eat fruits and vegetables raw, and that works. What do you think about that? Raw fruits and vegetables. I can't. I'm no? really sorry. I'm so <laughs> sorry. I think it's probably a great idea, but whatever works for you. Good time. Good time. Great time. Great time. All right, way to go. Congratulations, man. First place so far. Way to go. Way to go. Wow. You take advantage of the ice that you just carried out there? Yeah. <laughs> 22.5. 22.5. Right. Dude, you smoked! How'd it feel? 
was tough. Yeah. That's one of the first times I've actually felt a quad burn doing a small stair sprint. What are you doing there, Gabe? Chilling. Chilling? Yeah. Looking good. Right. <laughs> yeah, baby. Does that feel good, Jeff? That feels so good. Does that help? Right. How was it holding the block? It wasn't as hard as I thought it would be. It's got tongs that dig into the ice. Yeah. So I, I actually held it under. You held it under, and that yeah, was okay? No problem. The guy with the fastest time told me he didn't do the other event today. He had fresh legs. Yeah. So. Oh, he didn't do the other event. We just ran four, four and a half miles. So. So it's, it's a little victory, a little victory. Dude, you rock. Okay. I don't know what to expect. I really don't. My legs feeling tight and a little sluggish. So I'm going to give it everything I've got, and hopefully that's enough to get me to the top in a piece of time, because we need gas money. Come on, Larry! Here goes Tim. Is this Tim? This is Tim. Wow. Push! Wow. Go, go, go. Good job, Tim. Good job. Good job. Come on, come on, come on, Mr. Grimace. How do you feel? I gotta let you catch your breath. Toast. Good job, though. Just. Why they call it the ice cream? Oh, man. That was brutal. Yeah, definitely. I'm the endurance guy. I'm not the strength and speed guy. That was. Oh, man. I went so hard in the first race, though. There's nothing left for this. Jeff kicked butt. Yeah, I got to keep going. I was in second oh, for a while. And you're still in the money, though. You're still in the money. Of a second. Oh, man. You know what? If Attila beats me, I'm going to have to go do it. Yeah. My name is Gabe. I'm from Tucson, Arizona. Originally from Bisbee. It's up to you. I was born here, raised here. Just did the Barco Ice Man. Hopefully, uh, hopefully going to win. The time's best right now. So, What I eat is usually you know, as fresh and food as possible. Very little red meat. Uh, mostly, you know, a lot of vegetables, a lot of you know, light protein, stuff like that. And I'm also a firm believer in beer. My preferred actual recovery regimen is a beer and a banana. That's the best thing ever. Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Go, go, go! I've gotten a pretty good time. I was sitting in second for a while in the ice man. Somebody overtook me. I was bumped down to third. I was okay. I thought, okay, third's good. That's 50 bucks. Another guy, Attila, that we had talked to yesterday, beat me, passed me. So I decided I'm gonna run up for a second time, see if I can take back at least third, hopefully second. But I did. I took back third. I'm happy. Oh. Fifty bucks. Congratulations, you were the man. The winner of the Iceman competition this year is Gabriel Luthi. Twenty-two point five. High Desert Cafe in Bisbee. The people that work here are awesome. We're having salads and smoothies. Salad, smoothie. Salad, smoothie. Post-race recovery. Salads and smoothies. Gotta love it. Bisbee, Arizona. Great place.